I believe one problem with hiring women is that they're frail and breakable. Is it possible you're thinking about light bulbs or your hip? Mm, if I were 300 years older, Councilman. Incoherent ramblings aside, I've done some research and the female employment rate in government is abysmal. The number one offender, sanitation. All right. No, 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 stop celebrating. Why are there no female garbage collectors, Steve? I don't know. We hire women for other things. You have one woman, and she's a secretary. And she's the best secretary we got. Except for Dan. Dan's awesome. Dan. Garbage collectors make good wages. They have good benefits. I mean, they are the smelly glue that keeps this city together. You need to hire more women. Not that many women apply. Plus, it's a very physically demanding job. Your average woman can't handle it. Oh, no? Okay, so I took extensive notes on ways to maximize our efficiency because we can't be just as good as the men. We have to be better. Yeah, you're totally right. Let's rock this. April, I love you, but I don't need your sarcasm right now. I'm serious. Let's get rolling. I want to get into some garbage. What? I love garbage. You ever found a dead body in the trash? Or body parts? Like a torso or a head? Please say head. Hey, Dewey, Leslie brought binders. <laughs> <laughs> what do they say? Pick up garbage, put in truck? <laughs> Actually, yeah, that's what's in the binder on every page, because I believe in being thorough. All right. Okay. Let's do it, trash people! Woo! Let's feed the beast! This is Stacy Knobloch's house. I went to high school with her, and she was super mean to me. And now I know that she dyes her hair. I knew that wench wasn't naturally blonde. Oh, my God. She has to use prescription strength deodorant. This is the best day of my life. Hey, lady, someone just called in a pickup. We have to make an unscheduled stop. Hope you can handle it. It's not in the binders. A new challenge? Bring it on, Stevie boy. Woo! April, let's finish up. We have some stereotypes to overcome. And some privacy to violate. Yeah! Woo! Wait, no. The bakery called this in. Needs to go on that truck right there. Oh, easy breezy beautiful. That's a cover girl slogan. I didn't mean to say that. Okay, here we go. On three. Okay. One, two, three, move it. <sighs> On four, five, six, here we go. You need a hand? No, 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 we don't need a hand. What, you think Joan of Arc needed a hand? Doing what? Let me tell you something. We are not leaving until this symbolic feminist obstacle is loaded onto that truck of women's advancement. And you can put that on the record, Shauna. Well, you ladies clearly have everything in hand. Dewey and I are going to head back to base. Hope we didn't throw you off schedule. Not at all. Have fun. Hey, Shauna, maybe, maybe not put this part on the record. You know, leave the earlier part on the record. But if, if we can't get this fridge onto the truck, then maybe not put that on the record and then just destroy the record altogether. OK, guys, I'm going to go ahead and decide what's on and off the record on my own. Cool? Uh-huh. The whole city is watching. If I can't move that fridge onto that truck, then feminism is over in this town. I don't know why I thought sneaking up on it would work. If we start chewing now, we can finish before the sun comes up. We have to solve this problem, or they're going to point to this forever as a reason to not hire women. I should never have taken the bait. It was just such tasty, righteously flavored bait. You here to move the fridge? <gasps> are you a ghost? Yes, we are. Why do you think you can lift it? You are two little canaries. Those garbage men couldn't even lift it. They're like giant bears. Hold on, what do you mean? Bears are bigger than canaries, yes? So if bears can't lift the no, thing... No, I understand animal sizes. What do you mean they couldn't lift it? They tried three days ago, and it does not budge. They say they're going to come back with more guys, but they come back with canaries. Fly away, little canaries. Those sanitation goons set us up. You know what? Let's just go. What? No, we let's, can't let them beat us. Just call it a tie. Nobody can lift it. No, Leslie, we do not want to tie. We want to win. Those guys suck, OK? We have to prove them wrong. Look, all we have to do is get some PCP. You can move anything on Angel Dust. My cousin Heston, he beat off five cops on that stuff. OK, hold on. Sir, does this refrigerator still work? Works OK. We got a new one. We don't need it. Shauna just sent me the disclaimer that she's going to use before she prints the article. City manager Chris Traeger was present for this event, 
and has a personal relationship with the author. Okay, that's pretty good, right? Personal relationship. It's not romantic. But it is descriptive. No, it's not even descriptive. I know you're not used to this, but maybe you should just try to keep it chill and see what happens. Great advice. Impossible to follow, but great advice. So, do you think the soup kitchen could use that fridge? I mean, April and I were gonna haul it onto the truck effortlessly, but if you need it. Absolutely, this is a godsend. Thank you for thinking of us. Grab a side, ladies. I think all of us can get it on the truck. Not only did we complete the garbage route and move an unmovable fridge, but the sanitation department hired three new female trash haulers. And best of all, April gave me this present to commemorate our feminist victory. And it's trash. It's filled with trash. Maybe there's something on the bottom here. Let me see. No, just trash. Mm -hmm.